my lovelies so today I was going to go and buy a turkey but I can't really go out yet because I'm waiting for a phone call from a doctor I um, emailed them and told them that I want to speak to someone to refer me to gynecologist so I have to be at home with my phone just in case she calls me so what I think I'm going to do instead is wrap presents because that's need to be done and maybe later I will go and get turkey or I just do it tomorrow, I don't know. wanted to show you that um, I've decided to wrap most of the presents in just a brown wrapping paper it is much more environmentally friendly it's easy to recycle whereas you know with all the pretty Christmas paper it's all shiny and I don't think all of it is recyclable and I think you can make brown paper look really cute so you see i've put just a ribbon on here and little greenery you could put twine on it you could do all sorts so it can look really cute and it will look all the same and uniform under the christmas tree so that's what i'm doing i've wrapped a few presents in a pretty paper that's for my niece uh, but the rest is going to be in brown paper Okay, presents are wrapped. The doctor eventually called me. She was 50 minutes late, so I thought I will get out and try to buy turkey. So um, I'm going to Max and Spencer's. It is a bit early, but I will just freeze it. I'd rather buy it earlier than do it in the last week before Christmas when it's really, really busy. I will just buy the turkey and vegetables potatoes and stuff like that i can buy near the time and i also have to get a nut roast as a vegetarian option i hope they already have turkeys they should have do you like my top knot today <laughs> oh i'm fed up with doing my hair and to be honest, I thought I won't be going out at all today, I thought I'd be staying at home. This might be my last video this year, my darlings, unless I find time somehow, somewhere to film another one because, yeah, like next week I am so, so busy. So, yes, I might not have any more videos this year. Also, uh, straight after Boxing Day, oh, we are traveling up north to see my brother. So I won't be home after Christmas. Okay, so I'm back. I bought my, that's why I always buy, is the stuffed turkey crown. So I buy two of them. I also bought a butternut nut roast. I got turkey gravy. I've never tried turkey gravy. Um, I will do my own gravy, but maybe some people will like the turkey gravy. And I've got some more here. This is just a breast joint, stuffed breast joint. That just for us to have after Christmas, maybe. So I've got all my meat. I'm happy. I'll have to freeze it now because it's not going to last till Christmas. Hello my lovelies, it's less than a week till Christmas. I just wanted to say thank you to Anne. They have sent me beautiful handmade 
Christmas card. She made it herself. It's all blingy. Thank you so much, Anne. I don't know if you know, but I used to make uh, greeting cards. I actually still have some left that I used to make. I used to love doing it. So I wanted to show you what I've put now in the center of my uh, dining table. So that's what I will have for my Christmas dinner. So you see this garland that I bought and flocked and then I've got these battery operated um, candles. I've already had them so they are not new but I just got these and I think they're amazing. I will show you them in a minute. So I won't have the sheepskin rug here. I will have just white tablecloth so that's not going to be here but that's what I'm going to have in the middle of my table. This table extends a lot because I have to fit 11 people around it but I'm really happy I've put the lights now on. So let me show you these. These are so cute. Um, I got them on Amazon. I will leave you the link. So there they are. So what you do, you get these, the candles, you unscrew, you unscrew the top and they come with the batteries, you put one battery in them and then they have these clips that you just put the candle on and you can clip it, I mean look how nice it would look if I clipped it on my tree. This one doesn't have battery on so but I quite like this look and they have remote control it comes with a remote remote control so I can turn them off can you see oh hang on but you have to be quite close to them so you see I've turned off these two but the other three are still on unless I go quite close to them you see now they've turned off so then I can turn them back on. Then this is how this is how they flicker. And you can have them flickering slower or faster. And also how bright they are. This is not zooming in, is it? Come on, zoom in. So you can turn the brightness up. Okay. This is so hard to do with one hand. So let me turn them on now. So that's on. Now they're not flickering but I can make them, you probably can't see it because it doesn't want to focus, it says FL so I suppose that's flickering. If I press that you see they flicker. Then here this button that says SL you can make them flicker slower and then you can turn up the brightness or turn down the brightness but that doesn't really do much actually. Let's turn these ones on and let's turn the flickering and the good thing is as well where they sit, come on focus, where they sit in here this pivots, 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 piv pivots, so you know you can have them pointing the right way. Yeah, so I thought they were quite cute. I think if I had like loads of them on a tree, they would look really good. So yeah, I'm quite happy with my garland in the middle of the table. Okay, I've been buying more Christmas outfits and if that doesn't scream Paula Abdul or MC Hammer, I don't know what does. Look how 80s this top is. Can you see it? <laughs> and these like harem trousers, I don't know if I like them. I used to like them in 80s, but this is such an 80s outfit. Um, but I don't think I like it, so that is going back. Um, I bought a couple more tops, so i show you those. I might go upstairs and show them to you upstairs. Okay, so you know I bought that 
black sequin top from uh, River Island and I told you I really wanted this one. They describe it as silver but to me this is like a champagne gold and I found one online but in petite but I think this is too short. Let me know what you think. Can you see the sleeves are a bit shorter? Because I really wanted this colour but they only had it in petite. Now even the petite is sold out so I don't know if to keep it, if I had like high-waisted trousers, maybe I could tuck it in. I don't know, I just love this colour, but as you can see, it's quite short. So I got that and I got another sequin, like a silvery gunmetal top from Mango, so i show you that one. Okay, here it is don't like it at all again very short if they make everything so short these days i don't understand this and it has that black thing here it just looks like a sequin long sleeve t-shirt and this is size large i suppose mango is a bit like zara uh, things come up quite small although the trousers were from mango and they were size medium and i felt like i could go even small in those so yeah, I don't like that either, so that is going back. This haul was very unsuccessful. Good morning, everyone. So I am off to the gym. This is my last session this year. I could still go once before Christmas, but I'm just, I will be too busy. I'm getting really anxious about the Christmas day. I always do, I will be all stressed and everything has to run like a military operation so i usually on christmas eve i set my table organize the house and then i write down you know minute by minute um what is going into the oven first you know like plan out how i'm gonna cook everything so I need to be organized, otherwise I would be a mess. I'm a bit like that. I really don't know what's gonna happen to YouTube. There is so many changes. If you don't have a YouTube channel, you probably are not aware of all of this, but you know, with the latest laws, the COPA law and other things happening, YouTube is just so saturated that it cannot operate on the same model as it is now for much longer and there is a lot of rumors that at some point there won't be ad revenue anymore which means we won't be earning money that way there is a rumor that they're going to make youtube subscription model so you will have to pay monthly subscription to watch it a bit like netflix so i don't know these are just rumors by people in the know but i don't know what the future holds and i don't know sometimes i feel a bit lost in this youtube world i sometimes um wonder you know what is my place in here uh, what do i bring to the table so i don't know you know end of the year time for reflection <laughs> so i don't know as you know if you've been with me for a long time i started this channel to help you know more mature women with makeup for hooded eyes not that i am a expert or makeup artist just from my own experience and i think i've shared all my wisdom i don't think there is anything else i can share about tips and tricks and then it became a bit about how to feel and look good after 40 and i've been sharing you know how i deal with aging not that it's a disease or anything but you know what i mean oh my god the weather is just awful 
it's been raining for a week straight and today all the roads are flooded it's disgusting and I've got so much to do so I'm returning everything that I've shown you late earlier in this video the stuff from mango and the revival so <clears throat> I just have to go. Oh my god, choking on chocolate. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I just had a piece of chocolate. <coughs> <coughs> oh my god. So I have to go to the post office to send the mango stuff back because I don't have a mango shop near me. Then I have to go to River Island to return the River Island stuff. I know I have 30 days to do it, but I just want to have it done before Christmas and not worry about it. Now I'm going to the recycling centre again, because you know, all the stuff you buy from Amazon comes in lots of boxes. So I have to take all the cardboard to the recycling. And then I'm going to go and possibly buy vegetables today for Christmas dinner and I should be done tomorrow I am going to set my table I'm going to be very very organized I have to otherwise I panic and get anxiety attack <laughs> Oh, how are your preparations for Christmas going? <clears throat> oh, death by chocolate, honestly. I think someone somewhere is trying to tell me not to eat chocolate. Okay, recycling done. Now, off to River Island. Oh. That's the only problem with shopping online, isn't it? That if you don't like the stuff, you have to worry about returning. I'm still eating the chocolate. I went to fill up with petrol and I saw this, this chocolate with marzipan. And I love marzipan. But... I didn't notice it's a dark chocolate. I don't like dark chocolate. But it will do. I am premenstrual, so that's why I want to eat sweets. That's the only time. I eat sweets. Loads of them. In fact, my PMT is getting worse when it comes to... Is the progesterone. As soon as I start taking progesterone for 10 days, I feel I could eat a horse. All I want to do is eat. Oh, that reminds me. I've never picked up the referral letter from my GP to gynecologist. So I want to go after the year and hopefully have his hysterectomy. best thing ever. No more progesterone and no more periods from hell. Okay, I've done everything. I'm a superwoman. It's only 10.30 in the morning and I've got everything done. I've got my veg. I've sent everything back. I recycled and I bought urban decay foundation so i bought the stay naked you know the newest foundation i reviewed i reviewed it in the summer i really really love it and i can't remember but i think the color i have at home is 50 and why 
neutral yellow or w yellow i can't remember the colors uh, i was really lucky that that one was a good color for me in the summer but it's too dark for now so i thought i get 40 in the same thing well i've decided to go to actual shop to compare them and the 40 was darker um lighter than the 30 and i've got 30 cg that's what i got which i would never ever get cool so that means it's cool golden i mean how can you have cool golden cool is pink golden is yellow so the colors are really really odd you you have to go to the store and try them god knows you know under the lights they look different as well but i think this looks looks good so i will try it tomorrow and see if that goes and if it's a bit too light then i can mix it with my 50 can't i but that's what i thought i better come to the store because if you order it online and then if you have similar skin tone and color to mine then i've done the job for you but yeah it's quite the colors are all over the place i found that as well with the anastasia um foundation which i love as well that's my another favorite one um i have it on today actually and it is tiny bit too dark for me now but i just powder it with translucent powder instead of something with a color and then he tones it down a bit but you know the only reason i've done it so quickly and efficiently is because i probably have told you before i have to if i have like few things to do the night before i write it down and i try to work out honestly i think i'm a bit on a spectrum <laughs> um because I will write it down in the order that I will do it in so I work out what I have to do and what is the most efficient and quick way to do it <laughs> so I write it down in order of doing it and that way you know otherwise I know I would go to bed and I'll be thinking about it and I just wouldn't have a good night's sleep I don't know any of you are like this and but I tell you even if you are not anxious person like me and things like this really help because they stop you worrying about it and you do do it all more efficient way they say you should write things that you've got to do oh thank you what's the point having tickets then if you're just gonna let me out He's gone through the red light, naughty. Okay, I'm going home now. Hi my lovelies. So, I just filmed this look, um, party, New Year's Eve party look, uh, and you will probably see that on Friday. So yes, I managed to do another video for you this year. I just wanted to quickly tell you about this foundation, the Urban Decay foundation that I bought yesterday. It is a tiny bit too light, but when I mix it with my darker one, the 50WY, then it's perfect. I'm wearing that today. Uh, so I think I'm going to finish this vlog here. So all there is left for me is to wish you merry, peaceful full of love christmas i wanted to say thank you to all of you for the past year and um, my subscribers are the best i love you all and i hope you have a wonderful time this christmas and of course happy and prosperous new year and remember always stay fabulous and i will see you next year bye